Mayor Bronin says none of the officers are showing significant symptoms, but the chief says none of them are allowed back to the police department until they're officially cleared. These individuals have not been in the office have not been at work or reporting for duty uh, for quite a while. We also know an off duty fifth police officer came in contact with one of the infected officers prior to receiving the test results. That officer is also quarantined and will be tested. We want to make sure that we have um, a well staffed healthy police department and, and so we're taking measures that may be above and beyond uh, just to make sure that, that we keep that department healthy. Brian Foley with the State Department of Emergency Service and Public Protection has already had talks of enacting what is called a blue plan. If a police department is down, another police department will step in. It doesn't matter what police department or where it is, we're going to provide public safety and make sure public safety goes on regardless of what is happening there. Uh, obviously, Hartford did a decent job keeping those officers off the street and keeping them aside, and they, ha they have a deep bench as well. Also affecting Harford starting on Friday, Mayor Bronin is limiting social gatherings to no more than 10 people. Bars and restaurants have already been shut down. This would stop any other gatherings. But CDC guidance is now that events or gatherings of more than 10 should be canceled, and we want to uh, reflect that CDC guidance in our own local policies. Secondly, we just really want to emphasize for folks the importance of staying away from large groups. A Reverend Henry Brown, a well-known voice for taking a stand against violence in the city, says he has canceled all vigils and is conducting church services from home. What we try to do, we try to uh, congregate from home. You know, we don't try to go out in the public or come together with more than three or four people. So the Harford Police Department is also practicing social distancing, including roll calls, and they're also cleaning their cruisers after driving them. Reporting in Harford, Carmen Chow, Fox 61 News.